Hello again everyone and welcome to another episode of Gospel and Spade. Today we will take a look at the Corinth Bema seat. The remains of a large marble platform were discovered at Corinth, Greece in 1935. A broken Latin inscription was also found at the site of the platform which reads, he revetted the Bema and paid personally the expense of making all its marble. Based upon the style of the letters used in the inscription, both the Bema and the inscription have been dated to sometime around 25 to 50 AD. A Greek Bema, also known as a Rostra in Latin, was a public place where official proclamations were made to the people, and also acted as a place where both trials took place and legal appeals were made by citizens. In relation to the Bible, Acts chapter 18 verses 12 to 17 records that when Paul was brought by the Jews of Corinth before Gallio, the Roman governor of the province of Achaia, who I have discussed in a previous video, which link will be above, that this event, based upon both the biblical and secular chronologies, occurred sometime between 51 to 52 AD and it took place at the judgment seat or bema that was located within Corinth. Now based upon the biblical account found in Acts and the discovery of both the ancient bema within the city and the inscription which dates its construction to sometime before 50 AD, it is almost certain that this particular bema was the place where Paul was brought before Governor Gallio sometime during the man's year-long reign over the province, in either 51 or 52 AD. This discovery therefore once again helps to demonstrate the historical accuracy of Luke's account that is found recorded in Acts chapter 18, that a beamer was indeed present within Corinth during Paul's 18-month ministry within the city. Thank you for watching. As always, please don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe for more new content every Friday.